Hello, 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 everyone. This is Gonk, and welcome to my 59th triple feature DVD opening. It consists of the 2007 DVD of Night at the Museum, the 2005 DVD of Madagascar, and the 2005 DVD of Scooby-Doo in Where's My Mummy? So let's get started with Night at the Museum. This is my favorite 20th Century Fox movie, by the way. Comment below if you agree with me. So here's the opening to Night at the Museum. And that was the opening for Night at the Museum. Now we're going to move on to the opening to Madagascar, another famous DreamWorks franchise besides Shrek. So here's the opening to Madagascar. I hope you enjoy.
Hey, Steve. Hi, I'm Steve Carell. Steve! Pammy, not now. I'm about to tell the people about our new movie. What, 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 I'll be your best friend, please? Okay, here we go. Go! <laughs> Take it. I'm here to talk about DreamWorks Animation's new movie called Over the Hedge. We have scenes to share with you in various stages of animation. Over the Hedge, it's about a bunch of woodland creatures who wake up from five months of winter hibernation to discover a giant hedge running right through the middle of their forest. No! And on the other side of it, a hundred brand new homes. Now, they totally freak out, worrying about how they'll survive when along comes RJ. Now, RJ is this super cool raccoon, and he is played by none other than the big action star Bruce Willis. Hey, yeah, yeah, I know. Bruce has been in the studio all week recording some very funny lines that, uh, well, why don't I let him explain? Bruce, bet you're really excited. Hey, I'm excited, I'm very excited. Okay? My voice is coming out of a furry, computer-generated raccoon. You, my friend, are a natural. So here's how this whole thing works. I say a funny line in here, like this. Now listen, champ. What we're going for here is a vicious, man-eating rabbit squirrel. And the directors take it over to the sketch artists, and then they take it to the animation wizards, and it comes out just like this. What we're going for here is a vicious, man-eating rabbit squirrel. Can you handle that? It's pretty cool, right? <laughs> it's Bruce Willis. I was talking to Bruce Willis. Wow. Okay, then there's Vern. We want nothing to do with anything that's over that head. Voiced by Gary Shandling, Vern's the leader of all the animals in the forest. Now, everyone likes Vern, but he's a little cautious, a little slow. So everyone's just starting to adjust to life in the suburbs when suddenly RJ gets his big idea. R.J. sees a treasure of goodies to be had from his unsuspecting new neighbors and convinces his reluctant pals to join him on his mission. Clearly, the guy has seen too many spy movies. Lucky for him, he's got a lot of animal friends in this movie, like Stella the Skunk, played by the always funny Wanda Sykes. Why don't you let him sneak up on me like that, Vern? I was this close. And Ozzy the Opossum, played by William Shatner. I play and. A possum. <laughs> Must move toward the light. And there's Ozzy's teenage daughter, played by Avril Lavigne. Penny and Lou are played by the wonderfully funny Eugene Levy and Catherine O'Hara. They have their hands full with porcupine triplets. Shape up there. <laughs> and the irrepressible squirrel, Hammy, is played by none other than me. Take a hold, bury it, take it out, bury it somewhere else, forget where it is! I am adorable. Well, that's all we're going to tell you right now, because we're saving up a whole bunch of surprises. Oh, oh, oh. Oh. So, from the whole gang, excuse me, and Hammy, we'll see you over, over the hedge. hedge. Right? Anything else from you, Hammy? Oh, I can burn my ABCs! <laughs> well, like I was saying, from me and Hammy and all the other guys, we'll see you over the hedge. Over the hedge. It may be your backyard, but it's their world. <laughs> Are you there, Marty? Thank you. 
And that was the opening to Madagascar. Now we're going to move on to the last opening to Scooby-Doo and Where's My Mummy. I can recall the last Scooby-Doo opening was on a What's New Scooby-Doo DVD. So enjoy the opening to Scooby-Doo and Where's My Mummy. And that was the opening to Scooby-Doo in Where's My Mummy? I hope you enjoyed this triple feature DVD opening, and if you did, hit like, subscribe to all the things because your Timber Army members are amazing and always will be. I always say that because it's always true. This is Ken Calder 84 signing off.